Investigators have been combing a mobile home park for clues after someone uh, killed a man in Polk County. This is growing more and more interesting. Let's go straight to ABC Action News reporter Isabel Rosales, who is live for us north of State Road 92, which is right by Peachtree Street, if you're familiar. Isabel, what are investigators focusing on right now? What can you tell us? James, the real focus here right now is on surveillance cameras. They're hoping that somebody caught this person in the act. We do know that one neighbor, at least one neighbor, has already handed his own footage. I do want you to take a look right over here. Inside of this white camper, that is where the victim was killed. That's what neighbors are telling us. Now, a couple of hundred feet from the camper, what could be a crucial clue is in the grass. Take a look at our video here. Our cameras were rolling as deputies seem to be taking impressions of what seemed to be a shoe or footprints leading away from the homes. Now the crime happened yesterday before 8 p.m. But besides that, the Polk County Sheriff's Office is keeping tight lipped about the details. When it comes to the crime, neighbor after neighbor told me they would not speak on camera, saying they are too fearful they could be targeted. Now I did speak with the vice president of a nonprofit dedicated to revitalizing the county and making it safer. Here is what he had to say. It's a sad thing. And we're just uh, real concerned about it. I wish very much that it could be cleaned up. It's, it's just uh, very scary. Investigators are reaching out to the victim's family. As soon as they can do that, they'll be able to release his name. We're keeping very much on top of the story. As soon as we get any new details, we'll make sure to pass them along. Live in Polk County, I'm Isabel Rosales, ABC Action News. Okay.